Sup, y'all? So, yeah, I just thought I'd bring you guys the weighing results for the Murat Gassiev versus Nuri, the Albanian Tyson Seferi. As we all know, they'll be fighting this weekend, this Saturday, on Halloween Day, on the 31st of October, the last day of October, over in Madarosha, the home country of Mr. Gassiev, the former unified cruiserweight champion of the world, making his heavyweight debut over 200 pounds so no weight limit in this fight both fighters weighed above 200 pounds with Gassiev weighing in at 230.6 pounds 230.6 for Gassiev and Safari weighing at 225.1 pounds honestly I mean Safari looks kind of big bigger compared to Gassiev so I, I expected Safari to weigh more but uh, Gassiev weighed about 5 pounds uh, lighter compared to Nuri Seferi. Anyway, I'm just excited to see Gassiev back in the ring. He hasn't fought in 2 years. It's been a very, very long time. And uh, to fight in his home country, I'm sure he's excited to fight there after a long layoff. And as for Seferi replacing his brother in this fight, at least the money still stays with the family and it's a big opportunity for Safari to uh, go out there and you know try to pull off the big upset but who knows if he'll actually pull it off it's going to be uh, not an easy task to pull off to beat Gassiev in my opinion but I'm excited to see this new chapter of uh, Gassiev's career starting with, off with this one uh, if you guys missed out on my prediction video um, I'm picking Gassiev to win uh, simply because he's younger, stronger, he's bigger, taller. Um, you know, he's he's Gassiev. <laughs> so, it, it would be hard for Safari to win this fight. Uh, I'll be shocked and very surprised if Safari somehow wins this fight. But a lot of people are pulling for him. A lot of people believe that uh, he could actually pull it off. But I don't think so. I don't think so. Uh, reading some comments, D. Groza said Gassiev. Yep, I agree. Uh, Nebi is money said actually Nuri has fought also some good fighters, boxers in his career. Firat Arslan, Christoph Glowaski, Herbie Hyde, Mark Hook, Taras Bindenko. Nuri is a former WBO European champion, was ranked third in the WBO ranking in 2015 and 15th in the IBF ranking. He was never knocked down in his whole career. He never touched the, the ground as a professional boxer. Surely he's not in his prime, but he's not to be underestimated. Um, yeah, Fred Arslan, Christoph Glowaski, Mark Hook are definitely good names, but he lost all those names. Whenever he stepped up and fought good fighters, he ends up losing. And that's the same case here. Plus, at his age now, um yeah this is this, this is a sure win for Garcia. probably we will the will be the first one to knock out uh safari maybe maybe you never know right um uh yeah i replied to the comment saying those are those are actually not bad but at 40 plus i don't know man i'll be shocked if someone pulls it off yeah i will be shocked if someone pulls it off um Nebi Ismani replied to it saying me too but I think Nuri won't be a free pass from Murat also because this may be is Murat's biggest and last chance maybe to show himself on a big stage and he has nothing to, lo to lose anymore. Yeah, yeah, he's definitely going to go out there and give it his all, that's for sure. Uh, I'm expecting a knockout to be honest and I hope we get to see a knockout. Motion Mayor said Gaseb should be in the top 10 boxers. He is very strong and soon he will prove it to everyone. I don't know about top 10, man. He hasn't fought in two years, so he still has a lot to prove, especially after losing the title in cruiserweight, and now he has to uh, prove himself in heavyweight. I wouldn't put him in the top 10 right th right now. Definitely top 10 from the cruiserweight, but heavyweight? I don't know. Uh, in Sir Inner Silence said, Nuri Seferi has a much better chin than his younger brother. Uh, he doesn't entertain much, but he is a solid opponent. Still, I expect fully hydrated Gassiev to stop him with what I reckon a lot more power. I agree. I agree with that. Black Belt Troll said, Safari wins. He deserves it. What? Just because you deserve it doesn't mean you'll win. Come on. He was cheated in Germany in points at least five times. 
and uh yeah he said a bunch of other stuff that i don't understand but i mean if safari wins he has to win it in in a, a uh deserving way he has to actually go out there and you know outbox outwork outpoint knockout stop um right guys if he wants to win this fight yes because he deserves it doesn't mean he will win it doesn't work that way when it comes to sport of boxing you have to actually earn it obviously there are cases where there are robberies and all that and hopefully that's not the case here hopefully if somehow safari uh, makes himself look good in this fight and pulls off a let's say on a, a win on points but the judges gives it to gasseb i'm sure safari will earn a lot of respect and fans if he, he does it but you know we'll see we'll see anyway um i look forward to this fight this weekend let me know your thoughts in the comment section below um both fighters look like they're ready to go. Can't wait. Thank you so much for listening and watching. Don't forget to hit that like button if you haven't yet. Please don't forget to subscribe if you haven't yet. Please, and like always, have a great day. All right, thanks.